BBS. BBS. Black Burke Sugar, Bachelor's in Boxing Studies. Television! Fred Sanford of the Fisher Arts. When all is said and done, there's nothing left to say or do. BBS. The quote, Clarissa Shields versus Keith One Time Thurman. Hmm. Call a brother crazy. Call, call a brother crazy. Clarissa's bigger. Clarissa's taller. We're talking a two time gold medalist. She just might. Clarissa Shields just might be able to. Nah, hell no, nah, I ain't gonna bullshit y'all. Clarissa Shields don't need to get no ring with no Keith Thurman. I don't know what's going on here if this is a uh, publicity stunt, a way to keep herself relevant, and if so, applause and kudos to your mama. But no, the whole male-female dynamic, no. Uh, Thurman, he's taking the high road. He said, yeah, I'll do it. We can do it for charity. Uh, you can wear smaller gloves, Clarissa. I'm going to wear the bigger gloves. You can wear headgear. I'm only going to use my jab, you know, I'm not really interested in punching a girl in the face. Clarissa, you know, Clarissa's clapback gene is strong, strong. She's like, I'm bigger than you, I'm taller than you, you ain't going to fight me and not, hey, I ain't going to wear no headgear neither. You know, Clarissa, she bout it. She said, she just, she said, I hit a man in the face, I hit, I hit Keith Thurman in the face. She wants to smoke, I don't know what it's stemming from. It is a no-win situation, not just for Keith Thurman, but for any man. So if you go in there and you drag her ass in 30 seconds, so? Or worse, Keith, if you get in there and you bullshit with her, and she, she kind of tag you, piece you up real quick, you know, then what? No-win situation, bro. Uh, I think, again, this is Clarissa's way of keeping herself in the mix, because low-key, she also just signed, re-signed a multi-year deal with PFL, the MA, MMA organization. So she's going to continue entertaining that as well. It's, it's about mouthpiece. It's about mouthpiece. And Clarissa has it. What trips me out is the number of fighters and male fans who get so hot and bothered by anything Clarissa says. Oh, man, how dare she do? Uh, she's keeping herself out there, fellas. This is women's boxing. Like, they have to sell themselves. They got to do more than just fight. You got to do more than just show up on fight night. If you want, you got to sell yourself. You got to market yourself. You know, you can go to Layla route. She had her daddy, all that. You can go to Ann Wolf route, who was knocking out everybody. Well, unfortunately for Clarissa, she don't have power like that. Now, I think if they fought longer rounds, women's boxing, they fight uh, fewer rounds and fewer minutes per round. I think that would help her KO percentage. But regardless, she don't punch like that. So, she has to sell herself in other ways. Dudes quit tripping on it. A lot of y'all was offended when they said Bud Crawford was the first male to uh, become undisputed in the four belt era in two weight class. Why they gotta say male? Because a female did it first, fellas. And no, we ain't saying what Clarissa did is on par with what Bud did. But we gotta respect the accomplishment, all right? See, I'm in the middle of this. Yeah, if Clarissa's really entertaining, keep thumbing, She's tripping. But for those of y'all to get hot and bothered every time Clarissa opens her mouth, y'all are tripping. And y'all are falling for the bait that she dangled out there for you. And you're taking it like a fish. So let's all be better. Let's all get closer to the middle, all right? And keep up the good work, bro. Read BBS. BBS. Black Burke Sugar. Bachelor's in Boxing Studies. Televisio! Fred Sanford of the Fistic Arts. When all is said and done, there's nothing left to say or do. BBS. BBS. Black Berg Sugar, Bachelor's in Boxing Studies. Television! Fred Sanford of the Fisk Arts. When all is said and done, there's nothing left to say 